Hey everybody, it's Dave. Welcome to Holiday for Two. And uh, we are getting set up right now. We're out for the weekend at a place that we've been to before. But uh, it's been about a year ago. We were here at a place called Saddle Mountain. So we're gonna show you around. Plus, I got a little surprise I'll show you in just a few minutes. But it is beautiful today. Let me show you. There's Saddle Mountain behind me. It's like 75 today. Gorgeous weather. Stay tuned. I'll show you more about Saddle Mountain. If you like this video, don't forget to hit a like button and subscribe and ring that little bell on the side so you'll be notified when I put out more videos. So let's go to it. Take a look around Saddle Mountain. Oh, this is going to be fun. So someday when my ship comes in, I know just what we'll do. We'll pack our bags and quit our jobs and have a holiday for two. We'll pack our bags and quit our jobs and have a holiday for two. Well, it's easy to get out here. Just about a short, maybe an hour's drive from the heart of Phoenix. Take I-10 West, look for Tonopah Exit, or 411th Avenue, and you're gonna go south, Tonopah. Go to Salome Highway, and then uh, follow Salome Highway West to Courthouse Road. And then along Courthouse Road, there are actually several places along the road where you can access BLM camping area to the south. I, I, in this particular one, I took the major one, which is uh, on the west side of Saddle Mountain BLM area. And the road, this particular road, is very smooth, easy to travel. I would never worry about coming out here, even if it rained a little bit, because it's a lot of heavy gravel and not really a, a fear. I wouldn't have a fear of getting caught out here unless it really, really rained hard. It have to really rain hard because the gravel is so well packed and gravelly. But once you get out here, you kind of look for a spot that suits your needs. There's a lot of spots that are big enough for five, six uh, trailers together. If you make like a circle wagon kind of thing. We had some friends coming out. I came out by myself, which is Patch and I. And Tammy was going to come out later because she had to work. And she's going to bring the Jeep out. So I just brought the motorhome out with the trailer. And my new little toy. I'll show you that in just a minute. Got a little quad drive around on. And when you get out of here, you just really kind of, I suggest just people stop and kind of look around, maybe get out and walk a little bit and find a spot where they want to either back in or pull in. You'll notice there's a lot of little fire rings out here. And uh, just find a spot for you. And that's it. It's pretty level too. How's it going? Saddle Mountain was Patch's first camping trip last year when he was just a pup. Huh. Now he's a big boy. Well, we didn't bring the Jeep, or at least I didn't bring the Jeep. I'll tell you what I brought in just a second. Tammy's coming out. She's just getting off work because it's Friday. But she's going to bring the Jeep. And I have a new toy. Some of you know, if you've watched the channel for a while, you probably saw, oh, about a year and a half ago, we had a blue razor. And, uh, well, we sold it. 
to make a long story short, I missed it. I really missed it. But Tammy didn't want to do the riding thing anymore. So I picked this up about two weeks ago. And uh, I'm just trying it out. It's a new little toy here. This is an Outlander Pro. Can-Am Outlander Pro. HD7, I think is what it is. Yep, HD7. So I'm going to take it around and do a little writing on it. And uh, just put this on yesterday. Got it nice. Seals up. You can put stuff in there. And I threw a bag on the front. So... Uh, once in a while, Tammy might go for a ride, but it's going to be mostly me. Tammy kind of got spooked. Oh, about a year and a half. No, actually longer than that. It was January of... T or February. February of 2020. That's right. It was about this same weekend. We went out to a place uh, near Saguaro Lake. And did a ride and rolled sideways in the riverbed. And uh, we weren't going very fast, but we got into a riverbed. I had a choice of going through the water or going up on the bank. And I took the bank. It was a mistake. I probably would have been better off going through the water. We would have gotten a little wet, but I wouldn't have tipped over. Because as soon as we went up on the bank, the uh, embankment just kind of gave way like quicksand. And it just rolled right on the side right into the river. Nobody got, well, I should say it wasn't like we were going really fast, but when she reached up to grab the uh, bar on the ceiling and threw her shoulder out and tore a rotator cuff. And of course, that was right before COVID, and she couldn't get into the doctor right away because the surgeries were, oh, it was just a mess. So, bad experience. But uh, we did a few rides. She did. Still, it kind of was skittish after that, so. Anyway. I'll do some rides. I gotta get set up still. I got my solar up. And it is nice out. It's like 75. Beautiful. Wind's picking up. This is our campsite. The sun is starting to go down. It's beautiful. This is the new, the new bride. I took it on a little spin just to drive it around. The ride's really good. got some friends coming out and camp with us this weekend and yeah. and we got firewood too brought some firewood <laughs> so. you can kind of hear the road out there courthouse road Fire started. Somebody shooting over there, it sounds like. Alright. Well, hello there. Uh, Todd, you're just everywhere. What's <laughs> the matter, Patch? Aww. We're getting down to the, we have to buy some more lighters, I think. <laughs> What's the matter, Patch? I don't think anybody left food in there for you. 
It's nerds, don't they? <laughs> Here, I'm gonna put these on Dina's or somebody's. Yeah. What a pretty sky. Look at that. Oh, such a pretty sky. It was really pretty a few minutes ago. All the colors. I don't know if it's coming through the camera or not, but there's some really neat... Got like purple up here. And like light blue. And then red orange. Way over there is the I 10. Patch is going for a walk. Yay. Oops. <laughs> I was just getting a video of the sunset here. Well, time to get some pants on because it's getting chilly <laughs> it's getting chilly out here so I'm gonna go grab some warmer clothes believe it or not we were it's about 77 this afternoon 75 somewhere in there and warm felt good but as soon as the Sun goes down it gets chilly so I'll get my fire ready Cocktail time. It's time for cocktails. Time for the fire. Did you get the sunset tonight, David? I did. Did you? Me too. Did you have fun today, Patch? Yeah. What do you got? All kinds of good foods today. Hot dogs, duck. Steak fat. Steak fat. <laughs> Cucumbers. Which one's your favorite? Oh, wow. That's a nice picture, Bobby. Smoke. Oh, wow. What are you going to do? Take a picture of my picture? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Why not?